Hey guys, uh, in this tutorial we're going to talk a little bit more about the changes I've made to my website. Um, so most of the changes I have made are uh, occurred in the uh, cascading style sheets section of the code. So uh, the first thing I did was uh, I got some colors uh, off the internet. So uh, if you remember last lesson <coughs> we had <coughs> uh, inside the style tag we had body, background color is uh, let's say just say blue. So we had that and uh, see what that looks like now. Um, hang on. Blue without the hashtag. So that's what it um, sort of look like and uh, so now I've got some uh, proper color codes off the internet um, these are based on uh, hex decimal numbers and um, so the way you'd find them is uh, well if you go to google.com and you just search for our HTML colors and uh, there's all these colors you can go into to see their um, see what code they represent uh, so just go in there see what the code is for the color that you want and uh, type it in here uh, just after the background color uh, attribute and also another thing uh, is you can also look for HTML color schemes and then you get the combination of colors that are well suited together so you can see from my website uh, most of the all the colors here belong to the same color scheme so just go and in, click into a color scheme and that will give you the codes for the colors that you can use for your website so obviously the principle is don't use too many di different colors stick to three or two or three colors and just use them throughout the website okay so uh, another thing I have done is I have changed the font of uh, my P tag my H1 tag H2 tag and H3 tag so inside my P tag which is the paragraph I have decided in my cascading style sheet that whenever I use a P tag in my page uh, it's going to have a font of Arial so this is using the Arial font or Arial font or however you pronounce that and the color of my paragraphs uh, the font color is whatever this color is Okay, and my H1, H2, H3, they all have a font of Verdana and they all have another background color of uh, whatever this color is and color of that. So that's, when it just says color, that means the color of the words, the font color. So the font color refers to that and the background color is uh, this section here. So I have defined that for H1, H2 and H3. So try this out for your uh, home page. Try to change the fonts uh, and try to make the co uh, background colors and the colors of uh, your H1, H2, H3 and P and body tags different within your cascading style sheet and then come back when you're ready after you've played around with uh, these options. Okay, see you next time.